Welcome to Rhinos and Aliens. I will say one thing, though. Most of the teachers that we had named that were great teachers had got some of their education from ECC. So don't let um, community college or anything like that discourage you. I mean, me personally, when I, when I was going to ECC, it was a good time. It was just that um, there was a lot of things going on in my life, and, well, I couldn't focus the way that I would I would have... Um, Wanted? Wanted to, yes. But aside from that, it is a good place to get your education. Yeah. yeah. At the end of the day, when you think about it, a degree is just a certificate with a... With I knew you were going to say that. The way that I was, I was looking at it a little bit, don't take away... The fact that you invested your hard work into into achieving something that that fuck the fuck the certificate thing achieving something you know and even if it's not what you aim for it to be because of this experience you have a better idea of what you what you want to go about in life you know or what you would want to do or how you feel about certain things because you went past the what if factor you know. And at the end of the day, our rights, our rights is nothing but a sheet of paper. True. Life is not fair. Some people get the better end of the stick than others. Yeah. But you can only con- control what you can control. And if you're controlling yourself and in every single moment, you're giving your all. And when mm-hmm. you go home at night and say, did I do the best I can? Did I keep the best mindset or whatever you have to you have to look at that on the bright side and be positive about that because you always know, fucked up how some people are born into rich families they ha- never have to worry about their financials if you take that perspective yeah but it's like you weren't born in that situation so you have to work your ass off so you could pay these bills and stuff yeah. but how are you going to make the best out of it day in and day out definitely no matter what, live life to the fullest and never look at the glass as always being half empty. Think of it always as being half full because just giving yourself that leg up of being openly somewhat optimistic will always give you a better outlook in the long run. So. That's that that is my final words on that one of life. And that's just kind of one thing that I've learned. So Thank you. How do you feel about butt play, Chance? <laughs> butt play. Yes. Butt play can be your fingers, it could be your penis, <laughs> or my favorite, it could be your tongue. Um, Answer honestly. It's, uh, if if, it, if it's no, a no I, to all three, hey, that's that's fine. That's cool. If, I, if it's a I, yes, that's 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 groovy. I am just gonna say that <laughs> some shit happened, and with me and this one girl, and it did get there. So that is a yes for me. <laughs> was it the fingers? It was all three. I wish this was a picture of vodka. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please be a picture of vodka. Chance truly is the man. And ladies, if any of you guys hear this and you, you like what he's spitting, everybody loves a little butt play here and there. <laughs> or Jen, please be Jen. <laughs> if you want to subscribe, just hit this bad boy up here, that big fat rhino. If you want the newest video to the right, If you want the recommended to the left, and then, of course, our personal dick dick pic. pic. Yep, right below. So thank you for joining us once again, and we hope to see you next week. So peace out. Peace.